Tonight on Fox 55 News, Allen County isn't the only local community where people are pushing back against a new jail. Why some in Whitley County are also doing so. More small businesses popping up around the Summit City, but some experts say that's the easy part. What well, one local business is doing to keep its doors open. Despite the wind, it was another beautiful day across the region. I'll let you know if this mild stretch of weather will continue in your full forecast. Fox 55 News at 6 starts right now. The area's only hour-long 6 p.m. local newscast. This is Fox 55 News at 6. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Tara Brantley. The new Whitley County Jail site has some local business owners speaking out tonight. The site will be surrounded by small businesses, many of which don't want a jail next door. Fox 55's Stephen Walker spoke with one business owner today. He joins us live from that new jail site with our story. Stephen. Yeah, Tara, oh, you know, what the business owner Angela Grable told me today is that what is upsetting the businesses the most is the process to sell the property behind me seemed kind of deceptive. The previous business or the previous property owner had all the you know business residents of the business park sign new covenants and restrictions that would remove the property from their subdivision. No one really knew why. Turns out it's so the business owner could sell the land to be used for the new jail. Grable says the business residents they had no idea uh, she says that the new property would be used for you know the jail no one was told about it and as someone who has worked in real estate for 24 years she says it wasn't Fox 55 news at 6 continues with Tara Bradley the area's only hour-long 6 p.m. local newscast thanks for staying with us right now we bring you another live look inside the New Haven Community Center, where neighbors and community leaders are hosting a town hall. Their focus, raising concerns about the proposed new jail on Meyer Road. The Board of Zoning Appeals is set to make a decision Thursday on whether to allow this project to move forward. Some of